Nam Nyep One Power Company was formed by Kansai Electric Power of Japan, IGAT International, and Lao Holding State Enterprise on April 12, 2013, to develop, finance, construct, own, and operate the Nam Nyep One Hydropower Project. The company has its head office in Vientiane, the capital of Lao PDR. The site office is located in Bolikan District, Bolikamsai Province, where the project is located. The company also operates small satellite offices in both Bolikamsai and Saisimbun provinces to manage environmental and social aspects of the project. The Nam Nyep One Hydropower Project is a reservoir type hydropower project with a total installed capacity of 290 megawatts. Construction is underway in both the Bolikamsai and Saisimbun provinces. NNP-1 is designed to harness the energy potential of the middle and lower part of the Nyep River by creating a reservoir at the end of a steep gorge that the river has created through the mountains. The river will supply water to a power station situated on the left bank of the downstream tow of the 150 meter high dam. The electricity generated at this 272 megawatt facility will be exported to Thailand via a 120 kilometer long, 230 kilovolt transmission line to the Na Bong substation. Here, the electricity is converted to 500 kilovolt and transmitted across the Mekong River to Thailand. A second smaller 20 meter labyrinth dam is being built about 6 kilometers downstream of the main dam. This creates a re-regulating pond upstream of the dam in order to regulate water flows, thereby minimizing disturbances to the river and people living further downstream along the Nam Nye. A small power station of 18 megawatt installed capacity located at this re-regulating dam will supply electricity for use in Laos. The construction of the project is managed by the technical division of NNP-1. Obayashi Corporation and its subcontractors are responsible for civil construction works, with Hitachi Mitsubishi Hydro awarded the electrical and mechanical works, IHI Infrastructure Services the hydromechanical works, and Loxley SRI the transmission line works. NNP-1 expects to generate electricity in January 2019. At the end of the concession period, all plant facilities are expected to be transferred to the government of Laos. The NNP-1 project incorporates a complete set of economic, environmental, and social programs to minimize effects of the project on local people and ecosystems. The social development program mainly consists of a resettlement and livelihood plan. NNP-1 will necessitate the resettlement of approximately 3,000 people, originally located in four villages in Bolikamsai and Saisambun provinces. The company has consulted with these communities, the law government, stakeholders, and used local and international best practices to develop compensation packages to minimize social impact. As part of the compensation packages, the project is working closely with locals and authorities to build quality homes and community facilities for the villagers. The new resettlement village is located immediately to the west of the re-regulating dam at Huaisup in Bolikamsai province. The first phase of resettlement is expected to take place in 2016 and be completed prior to the 2017 wet season. The resettlement village will have gardens, irrigated paddies for agriculture, as well as public facilities such as electricity, water supply, a health center, schools, market, bus stops, and all-weather access roads. Under the new resettlement program, the project affected people can choose to resettle in the new village or receive full compensation and resettle on their own. To ensure food security and boost income of project-affected people, the company has worked closely with local authorities and communities to develop and implement a wide range of livelihood programs. Since the construction of the project commenced in late 2014, the company has provided training and development opportunities and a startup fund to community members. As a result, they now have started to raise fish, frogs, poultry, and boost rice production through improved soil and other techniques. They also engage in handicraft production and grow other cash crops to generate extra income. The communities also have been trained to improve their produce and find markets for produce. Currently, 
Fresh products such as vegetables and meat produced by communities are sold to NNP1's contractors and local buyers. Project has also commenced the provision of clean water to those resettling and to the host communities. The aim of the Livelihood Program is to ensure that affected community members enjoy improved living conditions and increase net income two times in 10 years after they have been relocated and participated in the program. Environmental protection is crucial to the long-term success of the project. The aim of the Environmental Management Program is to minimize its local footprint, contribute to improved conservation measures, and environmental awareness on a national scale. The program is also to ensure that NNP1 meets environmental safeguard policies set by lenders. The Environmental Management Program focuses on environmental compliance and monitoring, and watershed and biodiversity management. NNP1 is working with contractors and Lao governmental counterparts to ensure that it complies with environmental safeguard policies set by lenders and international finance corporation, including applicable rules and regulations of the Lao government. An environmental and social management and monitoring plan was developed and is implemented by contractors. NNP1 monitors and measures water quality and levels of dust, noise, and vibration on a regular basis in and around the project's area. To ensure water quality, NNP1 collects and tests surface water samples from nine collection stations upstream and downstream from the Nam Nyep River and its tributaries. The project measures water quality of effluent discharge, construction area discharge, and community drinking water to ensure it meets standards. NNP1 manages waste by waste segregation, recycling and waste awareness training. Waste generated by the project is segregated and disposed of appropriately. For example, after recyclables are removed, general waste is buried in landfill, whereas food waste is collected and provided to community members to feed their pigs. NNP1 works with local communities by initiating a waste management program, where the project buys recyclable waste and sells it to waste collectors. The program aims to instill good waste management behavior and keep their communities clean. Through government counterparts, the project supports watershed management and biodiversity offset programs, including biomass clearance. A watershed management plan is being drafted. To minimize the impact on biodiversity of the project, NNP1 works with the Lao government and consultants to identify biodiversity offset sites. The sites are being assessed and a plan to manage the site is being drafted. In addition, the project provides an environment protection fund throughout its concession period to support the environmental protection program in Lao PDR. The administration division operated from the Vientiane office provides administration and logistic supports to NNP1. This includes administration, human resource management, communications and government relations, and procurement of goods and services for the project. The Accounting and Finance Division is responsible for financial related matters of the project, including financial terms of conditions set by lenders. NNP1 is operated under a 27-year concession agreement. During this period, the Nam Nyep Hydropower Project expects to contribute more than 600 million US dollars to Lao PDR through royalty fees, taxes, and dividends paid to the Lao Holding State Enterprise, the government shareholder in the project. Lao PDR not only expects to benefit directly from the project through electricity supply, but also indirectly through local employment, community infrastructure such as roads and bridges, and through the use of goods and services supplied to the project by Lao businesses. Nam Nyep One Power Company is committed to helping the Lao government to alleviate poverty and bring prosperity to the people of Laos.